What's going on there, folks? Good evening. Earthmaster jumping in here with an update on uh, earthquake out here in Hawaii. Coming in within the last couple minutes here. This is actually a rather large earthquake here uh, south uh, southeast of the Kilauea Volcano. About 25 kilometers deep, a 4.9 earthquake coming into the area. Uh, it's definitely a sizable quake there. Uh, it's awfully, it's been awfully uh, quiet here around the Kilauea volcano recently. It has been reviewed by a seismologist. Uh, potentially, we could be looking at things stirring up drastically following this larger, deeper movement here uh, across the area of the Kilauea volcano. It's actually a pretty uh, large earthquake for that area. Uh, let's see if anything's being put out here in terms of. It uh, doesn't look like they got to it yet, but we should see an update. In terms of this earthquake around uh, the Kilauea volcano from the USGS here, uh, possibly tonight. Now, the Kilauea volcano has been uh, seeing a higher level of inflation here recently. There's that 4.9 coming in uh, just to the southeast of Kilauea volcano. Uh, the tilt meters around this area have been up and down in terms of inflation and deflation here over the past couple months. But this latest inflation event here, uh, we're at our highest level of inflation uh, in in about the past five years since the, since the uh, 2018 eruption there at Kilauea Volcano, which was a little bit bigger than, than these last couple eruptions we've seen confined to the uh, crater area. So uh, definitely a, a large, somewhat of a large earthquake there. We'll have to keep an eye on things. It looks like it did get downgraded to a 4.5. Uh, very shallow though. Look at that. Look at the depth there. It's got adjusted to uh, just below the surface. If that's the case, uh, we could be looking at uh, the eruption take place here very soon. Uh, and if you've watched my videos here, I've been chatting about uh, most of this earthquake activity confined south of the Kilauea uh, volcano area, at least a crater, lava lake area, and a little separate swarm over here as well. I believe we'll see fissures open up south in this region uh, compared to the last couple eruptions where it's been confined to the lava lake area. So this is actually really interesting here. We'll watch this. We'll cover this a little bit later on this evening as well in a complete update video. We'll catch you guys back here uh, in a little bit. 